Hey everyone, today we're going to be reviewing the Jurassic World Jurassic Gummy Surprise Egg. Now, this is a bit different than the captive surprise eggs. As you can see on the bottom, there's no flat surface for it to stand up on, so it just plops over. And if you can see right here, the seam is different. But there's also an air hole right here, which I'm not sure if that's supposed to do something. Now, having them side by side, you can kind of tell that there's a difference in quality. For instance, this one's bigger, while this one's a little bit smaller. Um, this one can stand on its own, whereas this one cannot. This one has more of a design pattern on it, whereas this one barely has anything. And if you can feel it, this feels like a way better plastic than this. So yeah, it's uh, not a great start. And according to the packaging, we get a free coin. Or metal. Nope, it says coin. We get a free coin. I don't know what they do. I think they're just a collectible. But yeah, that seems like an interesting marketing gimmick. So uh, let's open this baby up and see what we get. Okay, so when I opened it, I could still feel that it's like a cheap plastic, but also I thought there would be a coin right here, but no, it's just a Jurassic World logo. So that's a bit disappointing. But anyway, let's crack this baby open. Ah, jeez. That was really on there. Anyway, let's see what we get. We get two bags of gummies and a little metal. Okay, so right away when I pick this up, I can feel a weight to it. So this is definitely metal. But let's open it up. Yeah, this this is like an actual metal token. That's pretty interesting. And as you can see, it has a Dilophosaurus. You know, this coin actually reminds me of a, uh, a game I used to play when I was a kid. One I, I kind of wish they, they started making games of again. Not gonna lie, guys, I am a little bit depressed right now. Anyway. What the? How did you get, what? Wait, is this Fossil Fighters or Jurassic Park? Make up your mind. Anyway, now that that's taken care of, let's look at this really tiny booklet to see what kind of things you can get. Oh, it's uh, very tiny. Let's see, what does this do? Okay, so you can take a picture of the coins and add them to the website, I guess. I'm not really sure what that does. And over here, we have some of the coins you can get. There is quite a bit of them, but my camera does not want to focus because this booklet is so tiny. But yeah, there's quite a bit of these. Like, that's an interesting uh, way to get people to buy this. Anyway, let's uh, eat the candy. Do, 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 do. Oh, hey, Tim. Oh, hey, Bob. Say, it's such a swell day to not be eaten today, right? Yeah, it's such a good day to not be eaten. Wait a minute. Oh, no. I'm being taken off screen. No. No, Bob. Where are you going? No. <laughs> no, Bob. You were so young. Why? Why? By the way, Bob was a uh, orange flavor. Actually, I think he's lemon flavor. Let me try again. No, no, don't eat him. Okay, yeah, he is lemon flavored. No, Bob. Why? Oh, now you're gonna eat him. No, don't eat me. He's either cherry or strawberry. I can't figure it out. 
So Biden and these, they kind of had a bit of a weird coarseness to them. Like they had a weird coarse texture to them when you bite into them as if um, maybe the sugar they used wasn't ground up enough and it was kind of in a bigger chunks than it should be. Or maybe the mix they used to make the gummies was not coarse enough or something. I don't know. It's very difficult to explain, but otherwise, these actually taste pretty good. Yep, that is definitely blue. Anyway, would I recommend these? Um, it's a bit of a tough question to answer. You see, on one hand, you have gummy snacks, which you could just, you know, get in the candy aisle or the snack aisle. But the thing I liked most about this was these metal coins. Like, this is a very interesting concept. I really like having a collectible coin, but it's kind of weird that it's paired with gummy snacks. So, if you want to collect these coins, I would highly recommend it. I wouldn't recommend it for the gummies because they're a bit average at best. But anyway, that's the video. If you like the video, like, subscribe, maybe comment, I don't know, something else I could review. And, uh, until next time, bye! What the? How? What? How? What?